What up guys, Deep3 here with another Deep3 Reviews and we're going to check out the Hangar Pack debut of edition of the Donruss UFC 2022 uh, cards. 30 card value pack here. We did the blasters, we didn't touch the hobby yet, but let me know in the comments below if you would like to see that. And uh, yeah, this is a little bit of a quick review since it's only 30 cards, but let's check out what this has in store for us here. So 2022 set. 225 card set, 200 base, 20 rookies, 5 voices of the octagon, and we can find base green flood and rated rookies, green flood, and autos it seems like. So if we're lucky we'll hit one of those today. Uh, in the blasters you can only get the purple floods, so we're, we're a little bit familiar with that since we've seen one in the past. But without further ado, let's just get into the review. This pack is like $20 or something, $20 to $25 at retail uh, after taxes. So not the cheapest solo out there, I would say. But you do get 30 cards. Let's see if it's actually worth that price tag. I would consider this uh, one of the more higher risk boxes or packs to rip. Uh, I would recommend, right off the bat, just looking at the price tag, I would say get the blaster box over these solos. But maybe the contents of the packs are so good that it'll change my mind. So let's find out. So we're going to get to our base. This is how it looks like. Link in the description to the blaster box review will be uh, down there as well. Dilla Shaw, very clean looking card, paper stock. Magni, Neil, Chimaev, Kazmat, Silva, the Spider, Robert Whittaker, Ajman Sterling, Adesanya. You get a lot of base here. It's going to be pretty tough to hit rookies. Mackenzie Dern, Joanna. Oh man, that's a tough name right there. <laughs> Edgar, Frankie Edgar, Cody, and we already hit one rookie here, Sean Brady. Solid. Solid. Production line, Adesanya. I like him. Marvels, here we go. Amanda Nunez. That's another uh, Octagon Marvels there. I keep calling it Net Marvels from past videos, but uh, this is an Amanda Nunez pack here. So, three inserts so far out of the 30 cards. That's pretty solid. Duos. Oh, on the green flood. Very nice. Alexander Volkanovsky and Brian Ortega on the duos green flood. Wow. I can. S wow. I think we hit more than one green flood as well. So, maybe that is why the price tag on these cellos are much higher. Okay. Behind there, we got a Caitlin Chukagian. And, wow, more green. That's a lot of green flood parallels, actually. You normally don't get that much color out of a Donrosello, so this is justifying the price tag on it here. Alexander Gustafasson. There you go. And then I think the end of this is going to be some more base. Weedman, Jessica E, I, I, Eve. It is actually I, wow. Felice Herrig, Aspen Lod, Geoff Neal. Gunnar Nelson, Brandon Royval, Alexis Davis, Michelle Watterson, Macy Cheason, and Kudalaba. Interesting, interesting, interesting. So at a normal Donruss fashion, we do get a ton of base cards here. As you can see, this is no joke. <laughs> but on the other end, we hit one rookie, three inserts, and then three green floods. Now, is the, are the number of parallels in this worth it? It's, good, it's just going to come down to how much these green flood parallels are worth. But, so far, I think it's pretty amazing that you can get uh, inserts in the green flood coloring. So you can imagine what this green flood pattern, or par parallel prism from the duos, would look like on for something like the Marvels. That could be that could be something to chase for actually. That could make the cards look really nice, and uh, you'd have an, a nice little chaser to go for. I actually think these solos are worth it. They might even be better than the blasters after seeing what you could get. Now the blasters will most certainly give you more inserts and stuff, but this is these card this green parallel is very very clean. Oh my gosh. 
yeah, this green parallel is very, very clean to look at. It's very, very nice. And then the last green parallel here we hit was uh, Caitlyn Chukagian. So there you go. You guys let me know what you think about it. I'll have these up on my drip store if you guys are interested in stopping by and trying to rip them. Uh, maybe we can pull you guys some nice green Irish uh, Connor McGregor's or something like that. Maybe some Spida. Pretty fun pr product ripped, honestly, for a cello. I, I was not expecting to get so many parallels in one pack. So if you're wondering why the price tag is like that, there you go. Three inserts, three green floods. That's a pretty nice product. So I'm going to leave it there for you guys. Link in the description if you want to join my drip stream at some time. Referral links down there. Like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think about this product. I'm going to give this a solid nine despite the price tag they are definitely making an effort in giving you things that could be valuable if you hit the right players or right fighters in this case and three inserts as well these can compete with a blaster if you want more of the inserts i would definitely go towards the blaster box if you want more so the base cards in a green parallel you might want to go in this direction since you're getting three here i'm assuming you might get more than that possibly, or the same amount in every cello pack. So I'll catch you guys in the next one. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace.